Hi everyone, I'm Eva. Today I'm going to let you know how to define the cooling capacity of a graphic card and how it will influence your gaming experience. So let's start with this icon. This icon just presents by Gigabyte. According to this icon, we can know Gigabyte has new wind force which can solve 450 watts. 450 watt. So, uh, what is what? What is what? What what is what? What is what? The only thing you have to know is the more watt a cooling system can solve, the lower temperature you will get. Which means the longer product life you can enjoy, the higher quality gaming experience you will have, the lower noise you can hear, and so on. Okay, so here comes the more important question. Is 450 watt high enough? Well, compared with our competitors, uh, other manufacturers, their greatest, the, high, the most high end graphic card in the market can solve um, nearly 300 watt. In this case, I would say Gigabyte's 450 watt cooling has amazingly high cooling capacity. So let's prove it. Here. Follow me. What? What? Ow! Ow! What? Ow! Can you see the huge machine here? Um, this one is a simulator. Since no GPU in the world can actually reach 450 watts, Gigabyte create the simulator to uh, simulate 450 watt. Okay, so we wait for around 10 minutes to see how high the temperature will go. So after 10 minutes, the temperature is still around 70 degrees, which is lower than the limitation 80 degrees, right? So we make sure you can enjoy the high quality gaming performance with our cool. What? What? Ow! Ow! What? Ow! Okay, so you, wanna, you may want to ask me, why we need 450 watt cooling if Titan and GTX 780 can only reach 250 watt power consumption? Well, let me ask you, why not? You know, if you are a boss, which step you wanna hire? A step who can merely solve your problem or a step who can do far beyond your request? You know, it's easy to understand, see? Gigabyte's new cooling can uh, Spend like 50% effort, but reach 110% performance. When other manufacturer, other graphic card have to spend 100% effort, but can only reach 90% performance. So Gigabyte's 450 watt cooling can easily increase the overclocking ability and decrease the noise, decrease the temperature, and also extend the product life. It's easy to understand, right? If you keep working hard like a dog, you will die quickly. What? What? Ow! Ow! What? Ow! Why we keep mentioning 450 watt? Because Gigabyte wanna give the cooling capacity a new definition. You know how we show, uh, how we used to show the cooling ability before, right? Like how many heat pipes we have, how many fans we have, how large the heat sink we have, but None of these are important unless it has amazingly high cooling ability. So we want to give you a new definition to let you know how to define how good a cooling is on the graphic card. Although Gigabyte's 450 watt has a very nice resume as well. It has three anti-turbulence inclined fans, you can see, which is quite nice design. And also we have our newest and our patent pending triangle cool technology. Come closer. Can you see its triangle? When the wind flow goes down, the triangle cooling can direct the wind flow into different direction. So the wind flow will not hit the PCB directly, it will increase the cooling efficiency, also decrease the noise. If you can't see the triangle, if I take it out here, it's triangle, you know? The wind flow can go to different direction. This something weird looks like a, a Batman will use or Zinja. Quite cool, huh? Okay, it 
also have uh, six high-performance composite pure copper heat pipes. It's composite. See that? And we have six of them. The most important thing is it can solve 450 watt. And that's how it can show you a great gaming performance. So, uh, especially according to the latest GPU Boost 2.0 technology, high cooling capacity means high quality gaming experience. Let's show you here. What? What? Ow! Ow! What? Ow! So we have our gamer here, and he's playing Natural Last Light. And we have three monitors here. Uh, can you tell me how is the video quality right now? Oh, see, see, see. The resolution is amazingly high now. Okay, so we are playing Metro Last Light with the highest resolution with our latest cooling on our graphic card. You can come closer here. We have three fans here, which can solve 150 watt. You can hardly hear the noise. It's quite quiet, you know? So you can really enjoy the gaming experience. So can I can I know the temperature here? May I may I have the gun? Okay, so James Montgro are going to tell you the temperature. Okay. Do you see the temperature now? It's around 55. So even we are playing the popular game Metro Last Light with three monitor with the highest resolution for like half an hour or more than hours, we can still keep the temperature quite low. And if you're a hardcore gamer, you deserve this kind of gaming experience. If you don't have this car, try to get one. What? What? Ow! Ow! What? Ow! That's how Gigabyte presents you the land latest cooling. It has only two slot high, it's quite room saving, it has nice design, and the most important thing, it has nice cooling capacity which can solve 450 watts. So it's time for you to get yourself one to enrich your gaming device. So see you next time. Ciao!